back with another Let's Play. Today we are going to be starting the first of our Fallout 3 Let's Plays on the PC. Uh, this is a post-edit recording of my voice. I didn't time to go in and actually do it during the game. I should have because my mic was not connected when I actually recorded this. So this is a post-production recording. Not all videos will be set up like this. You will notice in the beginning of the video, I do not watch the entrance to the video because Fraps decided to stop working halfway through the entrance. So I had to go in and restart it. So here we go. Welcome to the Let's Play. Just gonna wait till everything loads up here. I am recording this as the game. I am watching my own playing, so I am sorry if I am not very good at this. As I said, I had skipped the entrance, so here it goes. We are going to jump right into the actual gameplay of the game. If you want to go watch the beginning entrance, I will leave a link down in the description where you can go watch another YouTube video on the entrance in case you want to catch the backstory of Fallout 3. But, on that behalf, I will give you a little backstory on Fallout 3. Fallout 3 is a game that takes place in 2077, post-nuclear war. Basically, what happens is there's vaults. You can either go into a vault, or you can stay out in what we now call the Wasteland. Uh, yeah, I chose a boy in this. But anyways, the Wasteland is basically the most desolate place in the Earth. If you were not in a vault, you were going to die. There are all different kinds of vaults scattered through Fallout 3. In this Let's Play, we are going to go over and try to find some of these vaults. Some of them are scarier than others. Some of them have nasty, nasty experiments going on them inside them. So, yeah, you will see that, hopefully. Uh, as I can see in my little video here, it looks like uh, your dad is the one that delivers you. I can't really remember. So yeah, my player name, my player name is going to be, oh yeah, in my actual recording before I noticed that the mic was cut off, this is where I started to explain what Fallout 3 is because I cut it off. So bear with me during this dead silence. How was your guys' day? Was it good? Did you have a good day? What are your plans for this week? Tell me in the comments below. So. Any time now, Aaron. I can't remember how long it took me to explain this, so hopefully this is not too, too annoying for you guys. I actually went out and bought Fraps last night. That is what is taking me so long to upload videos for you guys. I had to set up all of the data itself. Learn how to use the software. Okay, yeah, it looks like I went with the name Dick Tree in case you guys didn't actually catch that. Um... Yeah, so let's continue on with this Let's Play. Fraps is actually a really good program to use, but for $37, it's not really a bad tool, to be honest. You could have a lot worse. Um, hmm. Presets. I think I'm going to go with this one. I'm going to change my eye color blue. Okay, it's already set. And we're going to go to hairstyles, I think, yeah, I think I'm just going to leave it on this hairstyle, none of these look good. Alright, perfect. Hair color, platinum is the closest to blonde in this game, so we're going to go right over to platinum, oh, too far, and pick it. Okay, there we go, so now we're blonde, and facial hair, hmm, what's a go-to, rough beard, and yeah, those all look nice, but as you can tell, one looks like Hitler, that's hilarious. Uh, we're gonna go with Survivalist Beard. Just cause we're surviving. I'm a survivor! I don't know that song, so I don't even know why the hell I'm trying to sing it. Alright, so basically you choose what the hell you're gonna look like before you're even the age of one! Woo! New scientific creations, guys. We all gonna pick what we look like before we're born. We can look forward to that in 2077. I don't think I'm going to... Yeah.
one year later. I'm sorry, like I said, I'm not good at post commentator. It's horrible. Really, 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 really horrible. Okay, so I guess our dad wants us to go over to talk to him. Uh, let's see what's going on. I'm pretty sure he uh, just explains, yeah, he just explains that uh, your mother would be proud of you. And then he leaves a fucking one-year-old to fend for himself. Like, come on. But I guess we're kind of smart. Ooh, look at this ball. I wonder if I can go play with it. Whee! Kicking the ball. Whoa, computer just went all fucky there. Open the gate. And we're going to go straight over to this book and read it. So, I am just going to eat flip through this as quick as I can. Uh, you guys can pause the video and see how it is. Like, read each part as you go if you want to. I don't mind. But, the funny thing is, and you're going to see it here when it comes up to intelligence. You can... Intelligence is pretty cool. You can actually put your intelligence points all the way down to zero, or one, and basically your character mumbles where he can't complete sentences, he gives really fucked up responses. If I wasn't doing a serious let's play of this, I would definitely, definitely do that, just to show you guys how cool it is. I'm just gonna flip through all this. Alright, now, we're gonna put our strength up to about seven. Uh, yeah, we're gonna put our endurance up to seven. Or, no, we'll leave it at six. Nah, uh, seven. And our luck is going to go up to 6. Okay, there you go. As you go through the game, you get more chances to upgrade your skill points. And all of that jazz. That's great. Now we're just going to go ahead and jump in the toy box and play with Teddy. Whee! Hey, give me my teddy bear. Just going to flail him around here a little bit. Do you see this? Do you see this fucking teddy bear? Wah! Oh, I can't look over it. Oh, oh there he is. Okay, so, hey, stop pushing me out of the way, that's child abuse. I am not religious, so I really do not want to hear about this in verse from the Bible. Hey, stop kneeling on my bear, you're squishing my teddy bear's head, move, I can't pick him up, hey, get off, stop, hey, dick. Alright, let's venture down the hallway now to go see our friend Mara, I believe is her name. I can't remember. I remember, like I said, this is post-production recording. So, nine years later. Looks like we're at a birthday party. Oh, it's our birthday party. Awesome. So if I did the math correctly, we are now 10 years old, and here comes the vault leader, or the overseer as they call them in this. There's no such thing as a vault leader or a protester, or anything along that line. It's, or, I don't know what the hell that noise was in the background, but I have headphones on listening to my gameplay, so I can actually commentate along with it. Um, so here you are. Yeah, I, I have no idea what's going on there, my apartment. I hope they're not trying to get in here, because all that I hear is loud screaming. Anyways, uh, yeah, so they're going to put us to work at the age of 10. I, I really call it late work, but I guess it'll do. So, thanks guys for checking out this awesome episode of Fallout 3. It's a short little video, just seeing how the camera works. You guys can leave your feedback in the comments below to tell me if it actually looks good from your side of the screen or not. Oh, this guy's a little douche. He's so fucking god. But, uh, yeah. So, hopefully you guys actually enjoyed this Let's Play. I'm Sarah Penny signing off. Have a good day. Peace.